what's going on youtube and welcome back to another video on my channel now today we are going to be watching cobra kai season two now i've been preaching in the last uh, few videos that i'm going to have season three uploaded in january when it's released and turns out i've not even watched season two so lucky for you guys i've got 10 videos because there's 10 episodes that are going to be due to be released within the next 14 days before the next season so if you guys are looking forward to that please hit the like button and subscribe down below for all those new videos and yeah thank you for clicking on my channel today and hopefully guys are uh, off work now relaxing off school and yeah you're just sitting back enjoying youtube enjoying the festive uh period so thanks for clicking on my video and let's just jump into it and hopefully it's another great episode you want cobra kai's back where it belongs back on top that the real story is only just oh mate it's gonna be sick so that's how the end did the last season i remember now but man I reckon this guy's going to come in and absolutely shake things up. I'm interested to see the storyline between Johnny and his son within this season. I wonder if they can make amends and, and become friends or, or, you know, be amicable. Because it, uh, towards the last uh, season, episode uh, in the, the final episode, when they was having a fight, he seemed to have um, a lot of concern for him when he had his bad shoulder, when Hawk attacked him from behind as well. He was kind of supporting him on the low key. So I wonder if this guy comes in and actually ruins Cobra Kai. Maybe uh, Johnny starts another gym or something like that. I'm interested to see uh, this storyline. and I can't wait, to be honest. Hopefully he's in this the whole season because it'll be sick. Oh, he's never going to fucking shake here. Still got that hot temper, huh? Oh, here we go. Straight away, mate. Oh, Oh, fucking hell, man. This cigar's gone in the bin. He's going to start a fire in the gym already. For fuck's sake. Like, already starting on the bad foot. Do you know what, right? I just need to pause it because <laughs> the only reason why that nail went in, right, is because it was already a pre-hit spot. Like, the, the nail had a hole in the wood already that he already sunk it in. Like, he would never hit that whole thing in one strike. And especially, he wasn't even holding the handle at the bottom. So, like, if this is the hammer, yeah, he'd have to hold it here at the bottom to get the full uh, full swing. He didn't tilt his wrist. He'd just done his arm. So, there's no chance he would... Uh, that's just me in construction, but... False advertising. <laughs> Man, that looks sick. Yeah. Hey, the workman returned. I gotta... Do you know what, right? I've just remembered that the end of the last season, is his daughter called Sam? She started doing some mad karate flips or something in the gym. I wonder if she is going to become, in this season, the main... Not the main person, but the main fighter, I would say. So at the end, it was Robbie and um, and Diaz in the last episode of season one. But I wonder if Sam's going to be where Robbie was. And maybe it's the uh, it's the girl with the glasses. Or maybe she fights Diaz in the final. Who knows? But it looks like she's going to get into karate this season. I tell you, it feels great to get my hands dirty again. Hey, I'm happy that you found karate again. But opening your own dojo... Make sure you can balance that with everything you got going on. You can't let the bullies win. That is true, but I think in this season, yeah, this guy's the bully. Well, not in this, in this program. So he might have been a bully in the past in the movies, yeah, but he's the guy that's bullying in this one. I don't think that John has particularly done anything wrong. He's always he's trying to do the right thing. And this guy, LaRusso, is always trying to fucking tear him down. So you're the bully in this one, mate. Congratulations, oh. <laughs> Do you know what, right? Imagine, imagine, imagine if these two get together. Like, she is a good-looking woman, and they, they did have some uh, chemistry when he was having dinner with her in season one. So, mm, I don't know, interesting stuff. I wonder how uh, Miguel would that, uh, react to that. Miguel was lucky. I never imagined a few months later there would be an arena full of people cheering him on. Oh, she's making him feel good about the stuff that yeah, he does. Um, a called for Hello. nation. Hear me out. Midi's diner. 8 a.m. To be fair, right? Look, look, look. I know fucking... <laughs> I know shit's gone on, right? But, Miguel, 
in this situation with Sam, she hasn't really done anything wrong. Like, she does ignore him, or she was. Like, her phone was away, her mum took it away from her. Then she's always hanging around with this new guy that's Sam, um, that Miguel doesn't even know. And then she brings him to a party as well after he's been drunk. I mean, it's understandable, relatable life situations. Like, she can't be pissed at him. He's not really done it. I mean, he did punch her, yeah, but that was totally accidental. Like, it wasn't directed at her at all, so... Yeah, he took a massive L on that one, and obviously should never hit a woman. But it was totally accidental, so, I mean, take it as you will. But personally, if you do something by accident, then for me, it's obviously it wasn't an intended uh, action. So surely you can't be judged on your morals for that situation. Oh, she blocked him. Drinks, but the waitress was not feeling Hog's fake ID. Don't talk about that. My parents follow you. Is it me, right? Or does that guy right there look like Harry Maguire? I say it every time I watch the episode. He looks like Harry Maguire so much. Oh, he can't see her profile because she's fucking blocked him. The snake buries himself in a hole. The only difference is the snake doesn't sleep, waiting for the right moment to emerge. And that moment is now. I knew I had to keep fighting to stay alive. Kids today are caught. They get trophies just for showing up. It's true, man. That is true. Done. Yeah, it is true. Someone's got to step in and stop the ass kissing and start the ass kicking. You ruined my life. But I'm not a kid anymore. And you're not my sensei. I mean, when my dad finds out what we're up to, he is not going to know what hit him. Mate, he's still got like a li literally a grudge against his dad. His dad's trying to be civil as well, man. He's always reaching out, trying to do things. Ugh. You guys want to be Cobra Kai, huh? <laughs> you got a long road ahead. Okay, I do Why'd you do that? Did you purposely attack your opponent's injury? Yes, Sensei. I think that makes you badass. And the baddest badass is the one who beats his opponent when he's at his strongest. Talk you know? 50 push ups on your knuckles. Miss Robinson, warm them up. Yes, Sensei. Hey, that is sick, man. And look at them doing synchronized push ups as well. Right on those bare knuckles. Fucking, it hurts that. I take pity on Robbie Keane. I see. You don't know, man. Like, it needs to come out, man. Like, it's just like an elephant in a room that they don't know. And, like, if they're going to find out from somebody else, then it's probably just going to be worse. You might as well just come out and just say, look, he's my son. We don't get along, blah, blah, blah. I just don't want to see him get hurt, etc., etc. Like, there's no point in just hiding it. It's not going to benefit anybody. It's only because you have the potential to be better than I ever was. And stop whining like a little bitch and get out and finish your job. <laughs> Metallica. Noise. Rock on, man. Rock on, indeed, man. The, <laughs> the best era ever. The best era ever. Okay, Mr. LaRusso is always there, man. Use that to hang himself, but then the screw will be doing all the work. Shot. <laughs> Whoa, LaRusso Auto? Mate, do you know what, right? I'm actually... I'm happy that LaRusso just left and read the room because the beef is between them, but it shouldn't be between Robbie and his dad. I mean, Robbie's face there, man. Like, Johnny's always trying to get back. He's trying to do the right thing, man. Like, and I feel like every time he gets close, something happens all the time. It's just like, boom, 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 back and forth. And it's not really his fault normally. And it's like this now. They can't be angry at Diaz. I mean, at him for Diaz's actions. And, like, when he wanted to try and be nice towards LaRusso, then LaRusso's uh, cousin or his brother or something went and smashed Johnny's car. Do you know what I mean? He's, every time he goes, I have a good intention, something bad always happens. That's not his fault. And it's just a ripple effect down. So I'm hoping they could build a solid foundation relationship, me, because I think it would be sick together if they work together. I'm supposed to forgive you or whatever. But right now, it's a little tough. So instead, you're going to torture me by training with that prick. Hey, you don't know Mr. LaRusso. Not everyone has an insane karate cult that's brainwashing half the school. <laughs> that's why I'm opening up Miyagi. Well, then. yours is just going to do the same, you absolute idiot. You're going to brainwash them saying that they're the bad guys, you're the good guys, come here. But in reality, is you're fucking all the same. Like, literally all the same. Fight back. Take down Cobra Kai. I don't want to fight them. In it? Exactly. Instead of fighting him, just join him. Just be peace and civil. Enemies, exactly, man. Friends. Exactly, man. I never understand me. Like, why does one have to be better than the other? 
Do you know what I mean? Like, why? It's just like, why can't you just be the same and just offer people? Like, you should be just happy that all these kids want to learn karate, you know what I mean? And you should be respectful of that gym and that gym, that your passion is being shared by all these people. And instead of being, I'm better than you, let's get better people. That's the problem that this guy has anyway. He has it, like, Johnny has it a little bit because he just wants to be, like, liked because what happened in the past. But this guy, man, he always wants to be the best and he has a grudge over everything. The moment those tears leave your eyes, you lose. And I don't teach losers. Do you understand, Mr. Lawrence? I'm a winner! Man, you've already got a pre-drilled hole. There are no enemies. Your dad, his students, they're just like you and me. They Let's one sec. You've just been taught the wrong way. Hey, see, boom. Give credit where credit's due. This guy does me head in, but he's just preaching what I preached a second ago. Everybody's the same, man. You're on the same playing field. Like, it's dependent on what you've been taught and how you react around people. So, fair play, mate. Hopefully, we see a good season. Nothing through hate, just about pure skill. I would rather see a full season of sick, sick karate fighting than just two people bickering at each other. It's to show them a different way, right? A better way. Yeah, exactly. For them that's and fine. everyone in the valley. That's, that's fine. Preach positive yeah, stuff. Oh, she fucking does me, didn't man? Yeah. This place looks great. I mean, the house has been painted and the deck's been sanded. Does that mean I'm off the hook? Uh, no, we're gonna find something for you to do. Get on over here. <laughs> All right. Not even open 24 hours and I've doubled my roster. I got a good feeling about this. All right, you guys should both get some rest because this summer, you're gonna be spending a lot of time back here together. Oh, no man, fucking Robbie and her are gonna get together, and it's just gonna be a Diaz, Sam and Robbie triangle fucking season again, man. Pisses me off. I'm sorry. Hey, there you go. It takes big man to say I'm sorry. I realized that I was too hard on you. I fixed it for you. Mate, the guy's progressing in life. Look at him. He's taking leaps to be a better person. I like it. You were always the better fighter. Me. Wouldn't it be fucking sick if we had a LaRusso and Johnny fight instead of fucking Diaz and Robert and Sam shit? Get fucking rematch between these will be sick. Stay man. Hold up. Yeah, that's what he's waiting for, man. Okay, so that's gonna wrap up the video for today, guys. Uh it started off well. We had um we had Johnny fighting with his old mentor at the start, and then his mentor trying to um get back into Cobra Kai trying to well he wanted to see if he could be part of the ownership but obviously said no but then he come back at the end and give him his second place trophy and said that he fixed it from I think it was 1984 which just shows that his character might have progressed but you never actually know with these people they always try to slime their way in you have uh, Miguel's mum and um, Johnny who had a, a nice a dinner together something could happen between them it'd be very interesting and we have for Sam, she blocked Miguel on Instagram. And then we've got, um, what's her, Mr. LaRusso also opening his, up, his own dojo up. And Sam has asked, can she join? So now it's Sam and Robert. So I'm predicting a love triangle between these three um, in this season. But hopefully there's more fighting and more action to come. I would really like to see a fight between LaRusso and um, Johnny. I think it's much needed. It's just the elephant in the room and the tension. And I wonder how everybody's going to react when they find out that Robert is actually Johnny's son because that's still not been released, that information. But if you did enjoy today's video and you're looking forward to the more episodes being released on the channel and the brand new series that's coming out on the 8th of January, please smash a like on the button. It really does help out the channel. Thanks for clicking on my video and I'll catch you guys in the next one. Cheers, guys.